Yes, sir. Uh, oh, uh, I don't know if I need the mic or not. Uh, yes, uh, she said before, my name is uh, Dr. Orpheus Crack. I'm the, uh, Professor Emirates of uh, John Hopkins University, studying in the SOB, the Sexual Obsessive Behavior. And I see most of you reacted to that very nicely. <laughs> Yeah, so what, 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 what I like to do in my lectures, I like to say, uh, why do we, the word sex is such, has a, such a vile power over us, why don't we just all say sex together and let it rid, of, rid it of our, the power over us? So at 3, 2, 1, why don't we just yell out sex, really? 3, 2, 1, SEX! sex! Oh, doesn't that feel liberating? We <laughs> get rid of that sex and all that pressure. Huh? So, so, oh. Oh, let me just insert it here. Woo! <laughs> Down we go. Yeah. And to the side. <laughs> oh, so um, uh, what I'd like to talk about uh, is she asked me to uh, explain to you about uh, the reasons of uh, sexuality and then out of closet. And you've, uh, we've heard Tatiana talk. See, she's actually my favorite uh, pupil. <laughs> she comes to me for advice about sex. And uh, I'd like to give, oh, Tatiana, I'd like to give you some advice here. So uh, why don't uh, I need the help of uh, a any volunteer in the audience to come? Oh, lady, I saw the sparkler in your ear. <laughs> That's how I, I'm sorry, what is your name? Skylar. Sky oh, I had difficulty getting that down. Skylar. <laughs> Would you mind having a seat uh, here? Certainly. And then, uh, the reason I called you up here is I'm going to explain to Tatiana about her sexuality uh, mm -hmm. that we learned at school. And uh, to actually understand, um, I need, my memory tends to, to go blank. And uh, at any point I touch your shoulder, could you say any word that comes to your mind to, to make my memory more lucid in, in your mind? Sure. Okay. Uh, well, uh, the thing about Tatiana is that uh, you may see her here, but actually, in private, she's a very Diffident, diffident person. Very, you like oil and water, like sushi and sashimi, very different. <laughs> so, uh, she doesn't like to tell it, but she has a part of her body. Freud. <laughs> Freud. <laughs> Freud. <laughs> a part of her body that we all understand is uh, rather large. In the morning, it's very large, and sometimes. She has to trouble getting out of bed. I know that when she gets out of bed, part of her uh, her apartment. She lives in this area of Tokyo. Yoyogi. Yoyogi. <laughs> Yoyogi. And then she she wants to go to Yoyogi, and she works at this big company which is called Raw. Raw. <laughs> it's, raw. it's a very very enticing, very it's a not even cooked place. They give. <laughs> So she wants to go there, and, and she opens her refrigerator before she goes there, and she opens it, and her refrigerator is completely full with raw things. She likes raw vegetables, raw milk, raw meat inside of there. She takes that out, and she has, you may not all know this, but in the morning she bites into a piece of raw steak to give her the testosterone that gets her through the day. <laughs> After she bites it, then she drinks a bottle of... Chardonnay. Chardonnay. Woo! vintage that is very nice and she washes it all down. That is the kind of woman she is in the morning that gets her up. Raw testosterone and raw chardonnay. <laughs> That's why she's here. But then at noon, as she works in the office, she, 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 her job is... Oh! <laughs> oh! Her job is oh. She's a recording. She's a voice actor for porn magazines. When they ask her, three, two, one, please say, oh. She says, oh, in 20 different types of ways. <laughs> She's very famous about that. You may have heard her on the radio or oh. in a porno movie. <laughs> so she says, oh. In the commercial, she also does the, when the box of chocolate opens and it goes, oh. <laughs> <laughs> then she quits, when she finishes the job, she gets out of the office and she goes straight to... Mars. Mars. <laughs> it's right next to the Snickers counter. She loves Mars and she doesn't like peanuts, so she eats and gobbles down to Mars and then she says, I'm going to put on a show. You may not know this, but she does many things, many different shows all through Tokyo. She does the, 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 the shows at Good Heavens and she does the shows at, the, at, at here. And that's the guy, and also, oh, sorry. And she also goes has shows in, in, in Shinjuku. She does many, many shows, and she doesn't earn a single penny. She does it for love. For love. Because if you don't have love, what else do you have? So her love of performing for you is something very vile. 
something in, inertly inside of her that she wants to present to you. So thank you very much for all of you that come here. And next show, the theme of the next show is... Dicks. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.